Yo guys, this is TNN and today we're going to have a look at the Amazon Fire 7 uh, HD. Uh, this is the Amazon Fire tablet. Um, yes, I did get this tablet for £15, which is insane. Now this is not a paid promotion. I did get this from Top Cashback, so they got a really good deal. Um, I managed to snap this up. It was on sale at Amazon for £30. And if I use if I purchase it through top cash back, I would get fifteen pound cash back off of it as well. So technically I got it for fifteen pounds and I can prove it to you over here as well. Look, you can see fifteen pounds are ready to come into my account pending right there. So they do have some really cool offers. Uh currently they have a referral offer. So if I refer you, you guys can get ten pound cash back instantly just for joining top cashbacks. And then they also do extra offers. So if you're purchasing stuff on whether it's just eat, you get up to twenty one percent off, Argo six percent, boots up to seventeen percent, you know, various different stuff. Sheen up to twelve percent, Timu up to twenty three percent, curries up to six there's so many stores, you can get so many cash back and so many good deals and so many good offers. So it's not a scam, it's not a promotion, I'm not being paid for this, Top Cashback did not even contact me, I just wanted to let you guys know about this really cool deal. So I'll put a link below uh, for my referral so you guys can get a £10 joining bonus. And it also helps me out and helps this channel out because it means I can do more purchases for tech and do more videos. So, let's go ahead and let's have a look at the Fire 7. So I did go for the 16GB uh, version and it is the Rose version. I wanted the black one, but they didn't have any in stock, so I just went for the rose one. Just do it for the content. Uh, we are going to unbox it, and we're also going to completely hack this Fire TV. I, I'm going to try and do a complete hack, get rid of Fire OS. We're going to put Android on it. We're going to put Play Store on it. Um, we're also going to probably root it, and yeah, we'll do some all sorts of stuff. This is going to be a tablet where we just play around with it for 15 quid. We're going to put so much random stuff on this tablet. So, yeah, we're going to try and push it to its limit and see what we can get out of it. But let's go ahead and unbox it anyway. So, we got the uh, box over here, read, play, watch, can I, pretty cool. So, it's a 7-inch display with a pixel resolution of 1024 by 600. We do have front and rear cameras. It comes with Alexa. It is a quad-core processor. And you've got a micro SD card slot of up to 1 terabyte. So, the 16 GB version is pretty good because you can upgrade it. Got two gigs of RAM, not enough, but it's it's like it's it's not a lot, but it's it's enough. It's enough to do a little bit of gaming, maybe watching, streaming, stuff like that. So what's included is the Fire Seventh, twelfth generation, which is the Wi-Fi enabled tablet. It comes with an Amazon power adapter. It's a USB C charging cable with built-in rechargeable battery. Sponsored screensaver ads. Ads can be removed for a fee. So we did go for the version with ads. That way you don't need to pay extra. And I want to keep the cost as low as possible. But I'm going to show you guys how to remove the ads anyway. So when we hack this thing, we're going to remove it all anyway. So let's go and let's open this up. So I am a bit gutted I got the rose one. I, I really didn't want the rose one. But let, I mean, let's see what it looks like anyway. This is the only one they had in stock, a lovely pink one. Here it is. Comes pretty well packaged. It is a nice little tablet. Got a pill. Got the Amazon logo there. Got a little camera there. Power button. Volume up, volume down. What looks like to be a microphone. 3.5mm headphone jack and a USB-C. It is a plastic back. I'm guessing this is your SD card slot over here, so up to one terabytes. And then we've got a lovely seven inch screen over here. So let's go power this up. And it's completely dead, so we're gonna charge it up. Uh, we are gonna get straight to, into the hack as well, so I don't wanna mess around too much with it. What else do we get inside? Some important information card, which no one's gonna read. A quick start guide, pretty cool. We've got the Amazon plug, which is a 5 watt charging plug, and it's a USB Type A to USB Type C. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead, let's charge it up, and then let's go straight to hacking the Amazon Fire Tablet. So here is the Fire Tablet. It's charged up a little bit, and you can see already it's filled with so many just Amazon bloatware apps, Fire OS. So what we want to do is we're going to want to going to click the you leave the USB in it 
we're going to want to put it into developer mode so I think that will be on about and then where it says serial number yeah serial number I'm going to keep tapping that until it's unlocked developer mode then you want to click on developer options go ahead and switch that on And then where it says USB debug, over here we want to switch that on. Press OK. Sweet. So this is the Fire TV layout. Really basic. It's super restricted to Amazon only. And when you go on the lock screen homepage, you get random ads and stuff come up. Look at this. All this stuff. And then you get admin store. So we should now hopefully plug it in and the fire toolbox should pick it up. So I'll plug it in. There you go. So fire connected low power, don't remind me. Okay. Allow for this computer to debug. Allow. There we go. This is the first time you're running da da da. You could do a little tour. We could go straight into it and select the theme. So we'll select a lovely blue theme. Installation. Is there any way to skip the tour? I do not know. We'll just close it off, there you go. Okay, cool, you can run um, it on Linux as well, that's pretty cool. So it shows little adverts and stuff, so all over here, shows your latest fixes, change logs, boom, boom, boom. So, first things first, I think what we're going to do is do the Google services for sure. And don't need to do contacts in the calendar sync, so we just press execute tool. Hopefully, that should then put Google services on the Fire 7, the Fire Tablet 7. So, installing Google Account Manager, installing Google Services Framework, installing Google Play Services. Hopefully we should now have Google Play Store after this once this is done. So we'll let it do its thing and then we'll come back to it. Cool, so that seems to have gone through. Uh, would you like a toolbox to reboot the tablet for you? Go ahead and press yes. Waiting for a tablet to reboot. And if we now go on the tablet, we do have the Google Play Store. Simple there. So I'm going to go through all the other features as well. So I'm going to go ahead and install the custom launcher. Uh, and also I'm going to manage the Amazon apps, I'm going to install Google Assistant and also lock screen management so yeah we can play around with this and see what else we can do so with regards to the launcher I'm going to disable the fire launcher because I don't really like the layout uh, we'll enable widgets I'm going to install the Nova launcher because I think Nova launcher is very similar to uh, Google standard very Android launcher so we'll go ahead and we'll do all that so one of the best part is the lock screen management. Uh, on this one you can remove all the ads. So you can see over here, straight away, remove ads. Don't know why the focus is going crazy. Remove ads, you can straight run this one here. And get rid of all the ads from the lock screen. And there you go, simple as that. This Fire Tablet 7 is now completely hacked. So we've got no ads on the home screen swipe up we're now using nova launcher so it looks just like android you can add extra pages on your home screen you can also add widgets we've got some of the apps up here you can swipe up you can press and hold and you can drag apps and put it on the home screen we've also got voice search for google um, we've got Disney Plus, we've got YouTube, we can do anything now. Now that we've got the App Store, we can download absolutely anything. 
can see here with the app store you can search anything you want download whatever you want that is it the fire tablet officially hacked it's quite simple quite easy to do and yeah that's that with this video really um, I did try to root the device uh, to see if I could get it to root but I wasn't successful with able to root the device um, I don't know if you guys know how to do it put it down in the comment section below if you know how to root the um, Fire Tablet 7 um, but yeah I mean if not it's done all the most stuff anyway we've got Google Play services now you can literally download any app it can do way more than what it could originally do for 15 quid you can now do so much more with this tablet so as always thanks for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe and have a good one